morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I I've am been ready. dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. That is true. Now, in light of your unique and situation, never like joining the first us time. as a fifth year, to be fair. you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the oh, year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, to, your ordinary visiting exams. level exams. They will determine what type of Surely we're not actually going to have to do the exams. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Okay. Okay, a book. Here you are. Let's open it. Okay, I, I am losing all the pages. All the pages are going out the window. And through the walls. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. Okay. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Oh. That took me out of it, but we are wizards. Thank you, so. Professor. But what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Yes. Seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Okay. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Yeah, let's walk. Anything I can interrupt this with way. along the way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your the magic. Are sick. And educate They're very minimal yourself without about doing. That's creepy. Now oh, this one's creepy. I that's certainly good, would have good. appreciated something like the field guide when well. I was a student. Like that. Using the guide will oh, also train you floor. to be alert. Is that water? Or is that just? Do keep terrible. up. I mean, I'm only like five feet behind you. Okay, so we've only learned Lumos so far. I've got ah, three. The guide appears to have some information for you about that painting of poor Barufio. Simply cast oh. Revelio on it. And we'll Rebellion. Oh yeah, we always have Rebellion. We'll cut the page. Okay. A portrait of Pizza Wizard Barufio. Uh, the feigned for his brain of its uh, incantations are improperly spoken. He wants an S instead of F. And find himself in the form of a buffalo on his chest. Okay. I can see that. If you just unlock the field guide challenge, you can progress towards completely challenges that appear, that appear here. Okay, open the field guide. Okay, we've got level, we've got challenges, we've got collections, we've got a bunch of stuff. Okay, got room of requirement. Oh, exploration. Okay. So we have to collect one more of those to complete that challenge. Should be easy. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities so face like for that, person. inside and outside of the castle. Don't worry, I, don't worry, I will. I was a cat. Can I foster a cat? Hello. I can. No time Jeez. to waste. You have classes to attend. Whose Hello. cat is that then? I mean, I wasn't very convincing as a cat, but we'll let it slide. Then the very a little bit off. Why not which passageway? Got more money, okay. How's everyone doing? We're getting a personalized tour. What's this? Ah, good timing. Oh, perfect get opportunity out as well. nice. to show you how to use blue flame oh, flu to get around powder. a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay, open the map and find Central Hall. So we've got two main areas at the side. This is where students and professors live. Okay, live in quarters and then common rooms and the Great Hall. Okay. Step to South. Where's South Wing? Is this South Wing? No, is that South Wing? That's South Wing. Okay, green ones that we can go to. And grey ones are the ones we haven't been to yet. Okay. The right side. Okay. 
I'm going to select this. And then we need to go to the green one. Okay, simple. I'm going to try to do that. Oh, Quite the time saver. These stairs lead oh, directly page. to Central Hall. And we get the pages. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Very useful. As long as you just pronounce it correctly. This place looks incredible. Look at this. King's Cross Station, so to speak. The architecture is mental. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd Ten like to be already. sure you get to okay. Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Yeah, true. Um, we know that. We know what Hogsmeade is. We don't need to learn Thank that you, anymore. That. A lot to absorb on your first day. And you have much to learn. True. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments Side quests, for you okay. outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as Ooh. to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened Why after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Oh. He did say to keep it a secret. I'm going to trust him. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. He is very hmm. sus. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. I'm going to trust him. Okay. Speak of the devil. Speak. Yeah, Professor I was going to say. Fig, your ears must have been burning. Oh. Yes, you seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid oh, foundation working? in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. Also, we chose to fly I wouldn't a, say I chose the dragon's person. path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Okay, Thank that you. page flying around is intriguing me. How do we get the pages? Good Listen, luck I'll find today. Out. And remember Thank to you. use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And She's giving me Umbridge vibes, as well as McGonagall. As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those oh. supplies. Okay, nothing happened. Okay. Guess we can't do that yet. Guess we need to figure out what it's good to it see you, is. Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I okay. hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? You did. I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where it, this though? path we've That's embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster. That's what I think she might be telling Sam and Peg what we're doing. Between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Quite as Sam and Peg knowing what as we're doing. As capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so wizards. that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Please do. Okay, so this icon represents a main quest. Yeah, we have a lot to do. 35 collection chests, 150 pages. A demigod statues, 10 of them, and one astronomy table. Astronomy. I can't speak. Astronomy table. Okay, some quests are locked. Okay. Fair. 
What do we want to do? Do we want to do a charms class? Or do we want to do def defense against the dark arts? Uh, let's go to the defense against the dark arts one first. Oh. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Useful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. Okay, You'll wand. enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information well, about our before, yeah, mysterious that's rocket. What I know. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. True. We could die. Get attacked by a dark wizard. Okay, we're gonna go to our lesson. Alright. Oh. That's quite nice. What is up here? Revelio. Revelio. And then the werewolves join the goblins. Werewolves, where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> Oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flack. Ooh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack. Was the minister a boot or the minister a flack? Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't give Peeves a smack. She says it's a boot and he says it's a flack. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. <sighs> And you're both wrong anyway. It was oh, Hephaestus Gorm. Well. It wasn't Boot, it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> what is this? Okay, that looks way too intense for right now. You can't just... imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. True, I guess. We're going to go to our lesson. All secrets will be revealed in, due, in the right time. Let's begin our... Uh, what's it, what we're doing? A charms class. Where do we sit? Here. Oh. Behind you. I guess when we figured out where we're going to sit. Seat here. Thank, Thank you. you. That was very weird. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But uh, yeah. before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference so we'll between the incantations well. of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Oh. Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Oh, no. Mm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only okay. one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. She's got a lot of books. A lot of people on the right don't even have books. Ooh, a new spell. What would I... Accio. Boom. 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 And spell unlocked. Accio. Okay, so I'm guessing this is how we get the pages with Accio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. 
position Very good, everyone. Top That's of enough class. of that. Very well, good as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. Say. After me! I'm going outside. Okay, so here we go. We're outside. Uh, I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what we got going on here? <laughs> So why we don't are we have our new students start us off? Hmm? We've been eh? singled out. <laughs> what are we doing? Why is that cake? Why is that like cloak for a Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish the last. That's it! Now, we'll uh, think of okay. this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of... So she got it in the green, okay. Yes! Got 30 points of the green. Interesting. Jeez, what we've got the time in unlock. Don't fall off. That's it. What? Why does she not smile off? Does it get rid of my points? Surely not, because that'd be cheating. Get rid of this one. So we've got a lot of room. No, I want that one. I've been a bit early. No, it's great timing actually. Quite impressive. Yeah. Here we go. Surely we're gonna win this, right? There we go. No, I just need to get more than 30 and then I win. What do I get for winning? Ah, oh, I messed up, aren't I? No, I haven't. Use oh, armor natural. Perfect score. Remarkable. Yeah, actually, they get a perfect score. Jeez. What do I get for winning? <laughs> what is my prize, Professor? Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh, we're not we're not done yet. What's he done then? Oh obstacles that move. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Okay. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Let us see. So I just won that first round for nothing. She got 40. Okay, do I play this if it's match her score? No, 30, sorry. Okay, so the timing is there. I'm just gonna play it safe and get a match her score first. Control this. I just want to get the timing of the uh, boxes down. I guess she's got, she's got two forties in a row. Okay, two thirties. Why do I keep saying forty? Okay. I wait for it to move slightly. So, can't see because the professor's head's in the way. Oh, 50. Surely, surely that's fifty. Well done. What's yes. What's she gonna get for this one? Oh, we've won surely, right? Done. Yeah. We just need to get more than 10. Oh, we don't need to go. Yeah, no. Yeah, we've won. Easy. Splendid. Can we make this a competitive game mode? Because I am um, incredible at this. Very On both good, runs. Both of you. 2 0. Well done. We are just in the center. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get me anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Um, I'm gonna say that's good understand. to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Jeez. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world Uganda, at a new school yeah, in a new country. Far away. 
Um, it's going to end the conversation. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next I'm going to drag the conversation not too long for the video. I mean, I guess it could do audio. It could do of course, it could. you can yeah. use Accio on humans. It's very... A word, if you would. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I, I enjoyed the match. Like Miss Onai is always a, a fierce thing. competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Okay. Rebellion. Oh, I'm sure. Just level up. Hello there. You're oh, hello. the new student, aren't you? Yes, I am. Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. I'm saying whispering. I've heard every single conversation about well. myself, but you no. certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Um. It's been nice. I've been fortunate. After all. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. To begin, the defense against the dark arts uh, class. Stupid. Oh. Stupid. Uh, He's in slivering. Oh, oh no. Jeez, Professor that was close. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso! A surprise opponent is a weak defend yourself, Master Pruitt, no? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Okay, new spell. And spell who this? Levioso. Levioso. I'm sure, this is going to be a useful thing to complete in quests and get in the uh, pages and stuff like that. And find the secrets. Now, let's try something a little larger. Ooh. First, the main character, I don't know. Let us begin with the okay. basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, Levioso. Now, Okay. Good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. Oh, we're gonna be dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your mark. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want to get this one. Using only Levioso, 
basic cost and Protego. So I can't just simplify him. This should be smart. easy. Protego. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. A perfectly executed Leviosa. This can't be your first duel. Let's okay. just say I'm a quick learner. Oh, that's just say that. Oh, it hit me. Oh, no. Oh. There we go. My man hold the smoke. He gave Not me the bad for a beginner. Okay. You give as good as you get. <laughs> I put you on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Gryffindor. But, but, but. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I oh. demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So. I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Sounds good. Nice work. Okay, hello. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. I didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Uh, let's see, let's go that was. We want to be mysterious. Be you know, we don't want everyone like, knowing about I know us. Better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive unsanctioned dueling organization oh sounds intriguing. exclusive and unsanctioned count me in excellent knew i was right about you if you want to get the most out of your time at hogwarts you're yeah, going to need to rules. break the rules now and then if you want to be whether it's joining a secret dueling club break every rule or race. sneaking into the restricted section of the library you just have to be clever enough not to get caught exactly. thank you sebastian I'll keep that in mind. He can good. be a good guy. He can be a good guy. I'm sure I'll see He'll you be soon. The main character. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned. We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. Okay. If you're interested. Till next time. Because of the sea. What uh, Professor Weasley wants of us. What about oh, the room, elf. Professor? I Deke. was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. I learned about a room of requirement. Oh, I'm in the room. Excuse, Deke. Okay, interesting. Ah, there you are. You're keeping your own secrets. You're trying to get my secrets. You're keeping your own secrets. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? No, not really. Nothing more, Professor. I'll stick I to see. my plan. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In True. that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress oh, with some extra missions. assignments. Uh, yeah. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily oh, nice. to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcrafts. Thank nice. you, Professor. 
And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Jeez. You've managed your classes well Getting with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Uh, we're ready to go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. And I spent like a couple of minutes. I'm gonna go with Fur. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is more... one of our most talented students. And she knows I don't the know area. What I'm looking for. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the three broomsticks. Jeez, get that person. Okay, let's go see the uh what we got, what we have to do. Speak to Ronan, okay. Oh Ronan, is just say it. Okay, nice. Yeah, this is where I think if I stand here. Yeah, about here. This is where Thingy turns. What's his name? Madame Moody turns Draco into a. Um, ah, there you are. Into a ferret. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, what's, I what's do. A new spell. And an exceedingly be... useful one at that. The mending charm. The barrel. Fixes things right up. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have Sounds arranged fair. some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. I say less. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. What do we need to do? This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Jeez. There's one. Let's speed run this. Let me the in. flying page must be around here somewhere. Rebellion. Send out. Where is it? There you are. Oh, miss. Oh, no. There we go. Third time's a charm. Now I need to go back to Ronan. It's a very quick task. And we're going to be able to get through that page. Speak to Ronan. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, oh. your wand is a conduit of your magic. This is a more complicated one. Nothing I cannot handle. I have to switch the buttons up on me there. Can't catch, can't catch me slipping though. Easy. I think I want to notice the difference between a square and an X. We've unlocked Repero. It's pretty self-explanatory already good. in use. If you would like to practice mending oh. something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It Repero. allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps the Jewish lover thought it Jeez. too accurate and lashed out. Fixed it. Okay, let's go. Okay, so actually what we're going to do is we're going to leave the next mission where we get to Hogsmeade for the next video for part three of this playthrough. I've already called it two parts. This is the part two that you're seeing. As a, a professor in the background, there's this charms with the uh, winter birds there. Quite impressive. But yeah, we're going to go to Hogsmeade at the start of the next episode. So don't forget to drop a like on the video, subscribe to your channel, 
notifications so don't miss it out and then i'll see you guys in the next one thank you guys for watching and goodbye